Hi friends, welcome to Easy Deploy YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to learn about how to import existing cloud resources under Terraform management without writing Terraform configuration. Use case. Our client initially utilized AWS as their primary cloud solution, managing all resources through the AWS console. However, they expressed a desire to transition to Terraform for resource management across their three distinct environments, development, testing, and production. The introduction of Terraform's new import method in version 1.5 simplified the migration process, eliminating the need to manually write Terraform configurations. This streamlined approach alleviated the challenges previously encountered with the traditional import method, enabling a more efficient transition of resources into Terraform across all environments. Leveraging this updated feature, we successfully migrated all resources from each environment into Terraform, enhancing their management and configuration capabilities. What are we going to do in this video? Create an EC2 in AWS Cloud. Initialize Terraform configuration in the system. Defining import block for the EC2 instance. Generating Terraform configuration for the instance. Edit the configuration and run Terraform to check whether the service is imported or not. What is Terraform? Terraform is one of the leading tools for the infrastructure as code. It is an open source tool that will be used by more than 150 cloud providers. Terraform uses a simple script language called HCL, which is provided by HashiCorp. This is simple human readable language. Using Terraform, we can deploy, manage multiple services on any cloud providers like AWS, Azure, and it supports multi-cloud deployments also. Why Terraform import? Use the import block to import existing infrastructure resources into Terraform, bringing them under Terraform's management. Terraform can generate code for the resources you define in import blocks that do not already exist in your configuration. Terraform produces HCL to act as a template that contains Terraform's best guess at the appropriate value for each resource argument. The import blocks record that Terraform imported the resource and did not create it. After importing, you can optionally remove import blocks from your configuration or leave them as a record of the resource's origin. Prerequisites for this demo. Terraform installed in your system. An AWS free tier account. An AWS IAM user with EC2 full access. Visual Studio code installed in your system. Now, let's get into the demo. For the first step, we are going to create an EC2 instance using AWS console. Open your AWS console and search for EC2. Click on the EC2. It will redirect you to the EC2 console. Click on the Launch Instance button. Enter a name for your instance. For this demo, I typed Easy Deploy Terraform. Leave all the other settings as default. So, scroll down to the bottom and click Launch Instance. I forgot to select a key pair for our instance. So, select a key pair and click Launch Instance. Our EC2 instance is getting created. Click on the ID of the instance. Now you can see our instance is created. Now we need to set up Terraform provider configurations to import the resources. Open your Visual Studio Code Editor. Click the Open Folder link and select the folder that you want to use for this demo. Click the Create New File icon and enter a name for that file as providers.tf. Open your web browser and open a new tab. Search for Terraform AWS Provider. Click on the first link that shows AWS Provider. Scroll a little down and look for Provider Configuration. Copy this Terraform Provider code by click on the Copy button. Paste this code into the Providers.tf file and change the region as your wish. For me, that is US East 1. 
Replace the My Access key with your AWS Access key of the IAM user and replace the My Secret key with your Secret key. Please, do not try to use these AWS IAM security credentials to access our AWS account. I will delete this key after I record this video. As the next step, we are going to define an import block for the EC2 instance. Create a new file as import.tf. Open the Terraform registry page in your web browser and search for AWS underscore instance. Click on the AWS instance link and followed by the import link. Copy the Terraform code of import block by clicking the copy button and paste the code into the import.tf file. That AWS underscore instance dot web is the resource block name for our Terraform code and change the instance ID with our created EC2 instance ID. Copy the instance ID and paste it for the ID argument. In this step, we will generate Terraform configuration for the EC2 instance. Open a command terminal by clicking the button at the top right corner. Run the terraform init command to initialize the directory. This command needs to be run for fresh terraform code. For me, it took 45 seconds to complete. Now run the terraform plan, generate config out command to create a configuration file for our EC2 instance. Don't worry about the commands. You can find all these commands in the description. I gave a name for the new generated terraform file to main. Configuration is generated with some error. Change the file name from main to main.tf. You can see the Terraform configuration for our instance. Since this feature is still in the beta version, some lines need to be removed from the imported configuration file. This error shows that two arguments get conflicting. Either one argument should be removed. So I am going to copy this argument and find this in our generated configuration file and remove the entire line of that argument. Now let's run the terraform plan command to see what's going to happen while importing this resource. As you can see, it shows that we're going to import one resource. This means since we have only generated the configuration file for the resource, we still need to migrate the resources state into the Terraform state file. Run the Terraform apply command to import the resource state under the Terraform management. It asks for our confirmation to import the resource. Enter yes to confirm. Now the resource is successfully imported into our Terraform configuration management. There will be a new file created as terraform.tf state. It stores the metadata of all resources created by Terraform. It's time to verify that the Terraform can make a change on the EC2 instance. Go to the AWS EC2 console and you can see the instance type as t2.micro. In the Terraform configuration file, also it is same. Change the instance type from t2.micro to t2.medium. We are going to try to change the instance type from Terraform whether the EC2 instance comes under Terraform management or not. So run the Terraform apply command to execute the changes. Now it shows the instance type will change from t2.micro to t2.medium. Type yes to confirm the change. Now the code is executing. Wait for a minute to finish the execution. The modification is completed. To verify this, go to the EC2 console and refresh the page. Now it shows that instance type as t2.medium. So, we have successfully created a new fresh Terraform configuration file for an AWS instance, which is created via AWS console. And now our resource is managed by Terraform. 
From this demo, you learned how to import cloud resources that were not created by Terraform without writing the configuration for those resources under your Terraform code. This feature is especially helpful for DevOps engineers who plan to migrate their existing cloud resources to Terraform management without having to worry about writing configuration. It will also add the details of the resources into the state file where Terraform manages the metadata of the resources, those managed by Terraform. Do you have any questions? Please feel free to comment or contact us at our email ID or contact us page. We will be happy to reply you. Easy Deploy is an authorized AWS cloud consulting partner. We have helped various organizations in adopting their cloud journey by architecting, implementing, and managing their environment with AWS best practices.